Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I know it's been a hot minute. What can I say? Life's been crazy, the holidays were good, but now I'm here to do something super exciting and it's been put together by Heather over at the Needy Homesteader. I'll put her channel link in the description box. Um, she is here to walk us through how to make sourdough bread from the beginning. So your sourdough starter, all the way to making loaves and whatever you wanna make after that. So I personally have always been super in bleh, intimidated by making sourdough bread. So I'm super excited to do this because she has inspired me to do so many other recipes like pizza doughs, etc. And I know she'll be a great teacher. So hop on over to her channel. I don't know if I said this already, but I will put her channel link in the description box. So let's get started. We are going to start by making the starter. So here we go. Okay guys, so here we go. So like I said, Heather is kind of guiding us through the step-by-step -step on how to do this. So this will be video one. And I've got my ball jar here. And I do not have a kitchen scale because I am blind completely and I do not have a talking scale yet. <laughs> but it is on my list of things to get since I love baking bread so much. So I'm doing this the old fashioned way with just measuring cups, not weighing it. So <clears throat> here's my ball jar and in here I have one third cup of wheat flour. I was not able to find the dark rye and I'm really upset about that, but we're gonna go with the wheat. And to that, I'm gonna add the one third cup of warm water, warm to the touch, right into the flour. And then I'm just going to stir it up real good. And she said it would be thick. So yeah, it feels pretty thick. I'm doing this all by feel. <laughs> I do have um, people in the house that could tell me what it looks like, but um, when I bake bread, I, it's all in touch for me. So we'll see, I, I'm a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. So let's hope for the best. So I'm just gonna stir this really good. What do you think, Caitlin? You think it's? Um, yeah. I think that's mm -hmm. good. Is it is it is it supposed to be like thick? Like, yeah. Mhm. Mm what about lumps? Is it supposed to be? Any? Um, I'm supposed to keep it stirring until the lumps are gone. There's only there's only a few. Yes. Still see lumps? No. No lumps. Okay, so that just took you know a minute. So I'm doing this Saturday night. It took me all day to get to the store today. So we're gonna do video two tomorrow night. So I'm just gonna stick the lid on here, not screwing it down, just plopping it on. And then, stay right there. We're gonna put it in my oven with the light on, just like Paul suggested, which was a great idea. But I am gonna throw a towel over it and let it go to sleep for the night and let it do its thing. So we'll see. We'll see how it looks in the morning. 